okay since you are working with text let's also look at some few things over here so i'm going to say and this is actually the text this is a text align property we have with css and how then do we implement it in bootstrap so what i'm going to do is i'm going to put out an h3 tag over here and inside this i'm going to say this is bootstrap 4. so that's the text we have over here and let me duplicate this three times so or two so you have three of them now in order to align these texts we can put in a class here and do txt now when you do txt center you can see that this is centered and even when the screen size is big it is actually going to be at the center now we could as well also come in here and come and do txt now when we do left because this is already to the left we don't see too much of a change over here so the next one or the last one i'm going to do txt right and when i do txt right you see this moves to the right over here so these are the text align properties we see with our css we just have to apply bootstrap classes and we are good to go now as far as this concern um, one of the things i realized um, while using the bootstrap 5 the beta version is the fact that um, these things have changed over here i think txt center has been maintained but then with the um, the left uh, you normally see txt start okay because it is at the start of the text and the right as you see over here is txt end that's with bootstrap version 5 at least with the ones that i've used um, quite recently all right one of the other things i would also want to touch on is um, the text transform property so with the text transform property let me put out a comment over here and say text transform property so with the text transform property i'm going to put out a paragraph over here so with this paragraph i'm going to say a lorem a lorem and i need 10 words so this is what we see lorem 10 words and i'm going to duplicate this a number of times so i'll do shift down um, shift alt and the down arrow key so that's what we see over here now as far as the text transform property is concerned what we can do is just come and add a bootstrap class over here and that's going to be txt dash capitalize so when you do txt dash capitalize you can see that the first word of every word is capitalized now we can also do a class of txt uppercase so when you do txt uppercase everything will be in block letters or in uppercase then obviously we can also do a class of txt lowercase and everything will go back to lowercase